before anything the Lord wants your heart don't say I went to church on Sunday and I've done my duty I've been fasting for 50 days Ooh. no meat that's an ultimate sacrifice I gave up on chocolate for 50 days I didn't watch television for 50 days I started shivering at the end of the 50 days I couldn't wait for Sunday resurrection to come so I can breathe again I was choked <laughs> that's not love <laughs> if you live with someone and you're suffocating that means there is no love true why do people get far from all of you but why do people get divorced the moment love finishes life finishes there is no life everybody walks their way that life that household life is no longer in existence why because the moment that love finished from this household life finished from that household no more husband wife father mother children no more why because love stopped ended when love finishes you cannot live with the person not even a second because that second is like eternity it's hell so what is hell a place where there is no love the Lord the first thing he wants before you give up on chocolate <laughs> before you give up on Maccas and hungry Jack poor Jack he's been hungry all his life <laughs> I'll open a new franchise called the Field Jack. <laughs> or maybe Thirsty Jack. <laughs> this one is hungry, the other one is thirsty. We sell bottles of water and drinks, the other one sells hamburger. <laughs> that was a good one, wasn't it? Yeah, hungry, thirsty Jack. And we'll open a third one called Crawl Jack. <laughs> Before you give up on anything, the Lord says, I want you to love me. That's the first thing. That's the foundational thing. Love me first, and then I'll teach you how to live for me, how to live with me. I'll teach you. So when you, love, when you love somebody that is vegetarian, you'll become vegetarian for their sake. I'll give up. Because I'm not going to cook any, any meat and eat before them and they eat veggies, grass. So I'll give up on the meat. Why? Because I love you. I love meat, but I don't love meat more than you. So uh, away with meat. I want you. You see, it becomes so easy to giving up things for the one you love instead of fighting with yourself struggling with yourself I don't know how to pray I don't know how to fast I don't know how to go to church I don't know how to love the Lord just stop 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 you see you realize one thing you're saying I don't know how to do it I the Lord said forget about you Come to me, let me be you. Stop saying, I want to come. I want to do. Stop saying, I, I, I. No more. You live for me now. I live in you. Let me be you. Let me do everything for you. All I want is your heart. Lord, but my heart is full of spider webs. My heart is, is a piece of wreck. My heart, there's a lot of ugly things. Jealousy, envy pride hatred foolishness ignorance there are so many things give me your heart I am love I know how to fix things give me your heart when you focus on learning by begging the law love you but I don't know how Please teach me, Lord. Show me the way. I want to give you my heart. 
art, but I don't know how. I don't know where, when, how, what to do. Show me. The Lord will when you are genuine in your request. <coughs> when the Lord enters the heart, everything else falls in its place naturally without a sweat, without a struggle, without arguing and fighting. Some people, they want to go and fast, they end up fighting with themselves. I'm going to fast, I'm not going to eat anything, I'm not going to drink anything. And they spend the entire fasting period fighting with themselves. They lost track of the Lord. Satan came, made them too busy fighting with themselves and fighting with everyone else. Come, let's go. I'm fasting. I can't. I'm tired. Can't you see? I can't move. I haven't eaten all day. Relax, brother. Eat. Don't fight with your family members. You fight with your family and you say, I'm fasting. You broke your fast. What fast? Anyone home? It's the love. The love. When you love the Lord, oh, I can fast. I don't have a problem. Because your love filled me up, baby. I just done me fingernails. It cost me $100 at Fairfield Nita City. And I told them to put a diamond ring in this little one. Now it's old fashioned now. They go to Istanbul, facelift. Yalla. When you truly love, everything becomes easy. Everything becomes doable. Everything makes sense. When there is no love, nothing makes sense. Nothing is easy. Everything is crazy. So what is Sunday resurrection? Love. Divine love revealed for the human race, the entire human race. The Lord Jesus is the creator of every human being. Whether they accept it, not, acknowledge it, not, profess it, confess it, not. That's the truth. It will never change. Sooner or later they will find out and they will get the shock of their life. That there is only one God and his name is Jesus Christ. He is the creator of every human being. Black, white, yellow, red, whatever. Everyone. 